All right, so you want to see a shot from down here. There's the hole. And the idea is to, I'm just going to wipe down and paint this area. Uh, I'm actually going to use, uh, it's a membrane stuff we use for shower pans to make a shower pan. That'll make it airtight. And you can see the baffle up there. That sort of, you know, it can't go up the wall. Uh, it doesn't have to be neat. We're just making a, a hole, a hole, a, a hole through. And I think the easiest way to do this, because I got to come from here, would be to block this area off. There's a piece of wood left over. Block this off, make sure it's clean, and do the way they used to do for the return, like here. Actually, they did it here. That needs to be tacked up. But you basically take some sheet metal like this, and you put it over the joist, and you make a plenum. And we're going to do the same thing with this. Just for air now, so we don't need a, a 2 by 8 10 joist. These are 2 by 10s uh, I have a piece of wood that we're going to put against and block this area off. Probably close this so the air doesn't go in there. And the ductwork, you can see they're coming. It's going to come this way, turn, go down over the sink so it doesn't hit your head. And then right here in the corner of that work, we're going to uh, do the tin knocking to connect the duck to this area. And the air will come down there over here, get up in here, and go right up into the bathroom. So that's the game plan. Uh, we're kind of stuck for the day because, as you see up there, I sealed that. That's like a baffle, and it's at an angle to encourage the air to go out. I didn't make it flat. I put it up. It looks about 7 degrees, something like that. 7, 10 degrees. Um, so that the air will scoop out into the bathroom. That's the idea. So right now I'm done for the day because see that sealer up there? I sealed it. So I really can't touch it. Uh, it's in there snug. But if I start messing around, I'll knock it out. And I don't want to break that seal. I want that seal to dry tonight. So there you go, and we will get back on this tomorrow. Uh, all the plumbing is basically done. All I have left to do is this duck and the one for the dryer. And I got to tell the electrician, I was telling you before, this wire is in the way. So the electrician is going to move that because this is the path for the dryer vent. It's going to go right this way and right out through the side of the house. So that's the game plan. All right. That's it for this one. See ya.